cruises, we take you up to some of the highest sea cliffs in the Southern Hemisphere. We take you into caves, up against a beautiful blowhole. We stop, start, quality interpretation. We see a lot of the locals. We see a lot of seals, dolphins, and in-season whales. So these are Australian fur seals, guys. Have you ever seen anything make rocks look comfortable before? 95% of these seals are male and the other 5% are lucky. They eat fish and squid mainly, and we almost know them all by name. Bruni Island Cruises started in 1999. I started with a little 12 seat, 28 foot boat, and it makes me laugh now, but in good weather, I used to chase after renter cars and go to all the caravan parks to say, have I got a deal for you to try and fill 12 seats up? And we're lucky today that we've got a couple of great black cormorants, but check this cave out. We call it the Keyhole Cave. Let's give it a whirl and see if we're the right key today. A custom made yellow boats are a very important part of the tour. Even though they look like they're fast and thrills, we're into environment, we're into sustainability, but the shape of the hull gives a very smooth ride. It's important for us to keep people as warm as we can out there. We supply beanies and gloves on the colder days. The red jackets keep the wind out and if there's a little bit of water around, keeps that as well. And if you're still cold after that, all of our staff are fully qualified in the gentle art of an extremely good cuddle. We love everybody. We take our youngest so far has been two weeks old. Our oldest is 96 and a half. For me, it's really important sustainability. If you can't be sustainable, I don't think you should be operating a business. For me, from when I started, it's great respect for the animals. It's great respect for the community, my staff, and obviously the economic side as well. I want to sincerely thank everyone who has come and who are coming with us, because without them, we couldn't do any of the work that we do around the world philanthropically, so thank you.